your afternoon everybody and welcome to a new video. Today, me and Nala are out on our one time of the week where we're hanging out with humans. I can't oh, see it, literally, you can't see really. anything. We're, we're hanging out with cabbages. <laughs> what do you mean cabbages? Going shopping for look food. at you, you look like a ninja with your glasses on with your mask. Anyway, we're about to do our weekly food shop. We thought we'd do it with you today and then we'll show you everything we pick up when we get back. But um, yeah, we'll you ready? For a big thing. A big ting. We're gonna yeah, go a for a ting. big ting. Stuff. Yeah, we need to have a barbecue. Look at this weather. Do you know what? Tomorrow. Do you know what I was just thinking? Do you have a barbecue tomorrow. What? How much I love shopping when it's hot because it's of the fridges in there. It's so nice and cool in there, isn't it? I love it. Um, <laughs> when it's sunny, she likes being inside in cold. Place. No, but it's nice to have that little break. Get your food. Have a bit of a cool down in the fridges. Get some ice creams. Get some beers. Anyways, also, look. We're and current, get some stuff for the barbie. Currently going to Sunsbury's. <laughs> Sunsbury's. <laughs> right, one thing that we've started doing since lockdown is, well, actually, just because it's I summer started. as well. Yeah, Niall started it, to be fair. Tell him. Tell him your tradition. Huh? Tell the tradition. Well, I think it was one of the first times we came to do our weekly shop, and you had already, well, we pay separately, didn't we? And you had already finished and gone to the car. And I, <laughs> I surprised you with a bunch of flowers. Yeah, weren't they rainbow flowers too? Yeah, they were, that's why I got them. Yeah, so that's what we do now, and I feel like it just brightens up the house. So I've been loving sunflowers, but then I also do love a rainbow rose set. Don't know if they've got any today, but I just like a bit of colour to spice up the house because we spend so much time in the house now. What should we get? I don't know. I don't know much about flowers, you know. I love a peony, but they seem to be out of season. But I think I'm going to go for one of these now because they're nice and bright. Any thoughts? Love them? Love them. Get them in. Get them in. <laughs> Nail's having some trouble. <laughs> get in there. <laughs> get it back on. Naughty. You know what I was thinking that's really sad about these face masks? I can't you... see your beautiful face. <laughs> oh, cute. No, I was going to say, you can't smile at people when they're walking by. So I always try and smile with my eyes now, so I'm like, <laughs> I'm smiling. <laughs> I like smiling at people because it makes people stay. Have you got crow's feet? Sorry? Have you got crow's feet when you smile? Yeah. You know what that means? It's a good thing. What does it mean? That you Can like... You smile a lot. You're animated. I'm animated with my wrinkly eyes. Uh, Niall's got some tips to tell you for cooking at home. Come on. Um, well, when you cook stuff, <laughs> you need the ingredients for the recipe, so it's a good idea to buy the ingredients. Niall, you know what I mean? What you said the other day was good. Nah, well, I always like to make sure I've got, you know, fresh ginger, fresh garlic, some chilies. Basil, coriander, you know these things that are quite sort of Basil. taking your dishes to the next level. If you don't have them, you're going to get caught out and your food's going to taste like rubbish. Well, it's just going to taste plain, isn't it? Because yeah. I never so used we to always, use... Well, you, like, last year we, you did the food shop and you came back with a, a bunch of basil. I know. And Look, I that's because like, of Basil well, the doggy. And we hadn't even planned to use it, but it's Basil? just, you know, how I like to have them in the fridge. Well, I never actually addressed this, but you know now I was going on about his Basil plant. It was because of Basil the dog. I'm guessing you guys know that now. Basil. We, you I made such that. a fuss over his Basil tree. It was because he secretly knew we were calling our dog Basil. Yes. This aisle is my favourite. Well, one of my favourite aisles in the shop. We always get these crunchy yogurts. Love them. In they go. Couple more, why not? Couple more crunchy yogurts. In they go. Favourite dessert ever, isn't it? Yeah, it could be. Or I can eat it. Just say yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, this is another aisle. Me and Niall have been. <laughs> you, rhyme, you rhyme with aisle. This is another aisle that me and Niall. <laughs> it's really not that funny, is it? <laughs> Yeah, we love a bit of cheese. I think we've actually got enough at the moment, but we usually get a cheddar, but I think we've got one. A Philadelphia, but we've got one. We go to the special section. Smoky we've been loving this been, one, haven't we? Been nice recently. Love a bit of smoky cheddar. Is that Mexican style oh, chili cheddar? When did we not get that? That wasn't there last time, then. And this is my favourite, but I've still got some left, so. Love a bit of boisson. Boisson. <laughs> so close. Love a bit of bourson, bourson. Merci beaucoup. Eh, on deux. Un bourson, s'il vous plaît. That's good. 
Well, yeah, I'm French. Come on, hon. I'm French. <laughs> no, you're not. Yeah. Guys, guys, look. To make your time Basil. As stress-free as possible. And Dill, which is the name of Basil's brother who my mum has. Basil. And Dill. Literally, Niall took a picture of these two herbs before we had them and put them on his story like, oh, my favourite kind of herbs. But they actually weren't. He was just doing it to tease. I hate them. You hate dill? How rude. Do you know what's another tradition that I've got into since lockdown? Getting myself a pack of chocolate for the weekend. And I mix it up each week. Ooh. I love it. No. Usually we do go for caramel nibbles, don't we? Like I just like eating them on the sofa on a Friday and Saturday night. And see which ones I'm feeling this week. Are some crunchy rocks. Right. Yeah, they sound nice, don't they? Yeah. Well, I usually go for one of these and we just have them to snack on over the weekend. Love it. Right, guys, we're now in the alcohol section. Usually, I go up here to my Whitney Nail Blackberry. My camera still doesn't want to be in focus. There we go. Love them. They've also got blood orange here. And they've also got rhubarb in the Whitney Nail. And they've also got gooseberry. Definitely my favourite. They also actually have a mini one, which is so cute. Oh, look, it's us. <laughs> and then we've got the little mini there, which is very cute if you want to try a little Whitney Nail Blackberry, isn't it? He is going to go nuts with that. Right, we're getting the dogs. And we'll get proper little soup. But we're getting the dogs a little weekend treat from the Lily's Kitchen section. <gasps> Chicken and turkey, lamb hot pot. Which one should we get? What's this one? Cottage pie. Should we get cottage pie? I don't think she's had cottage pie before. Right, we'll get bluey cottage pie. Yeep. And we'll get Bazzy the puppy one. That's so good they've got a puppy one. Oh my gosh, I did not know Lily's Kitchen did cat food as well. They've got little cat ones. Oh my god, how cute. I'm going to get Poppy a catch of the day. Lily's Kitchen is just the best, isn't it? Just the best. Just the best. Where's our little doggy? Hi, Blue. Here's your brother. Should you go get your brother out? I'm waiting for the squeak. Oh, did you hear that? Wait there. When I left, he was fuming with me. There's your bro. Oh, hello. Oh, there he is. Missed you. Oh, we're going to get him. are just too cute. I literally feel so loved whenever I cut, I mean, not that I go out that much, but if I do, I feel so loved. Hi. You're gonna go for a wee before you wee yourself? Come on then. <laughs> Still moaning, we're home now. We're home, it's all good. Right, we're home. I've got all the food out, so I'm going to run through everything with you. I did show you some bits in the shop, but I'm going to run through everything and show you what we got. We got a big, big shop this week, didn't we? Big one. It's a big one. So, let's start. Actually, I think I'm going to start with my snacks. What's That's that? how you make good sushi. <laughs> That's how you make good sushi. Bamboo sticks. Yeah, it is, to be fair. We're starting with our snacks, we have the Maryland cookies. So, these are my chocolatey snacks. I just love a cookie. Cookies are just my favourite. I literally love them. I also love the baked cookies in the um, packs that they do oh, yeah, the bakery did, section. I, but I chose Maryland this week. Some weeks I choose them. It depends. And then I also have my crunchy yogurts. And we have, there's quite a lot of crunchy today. We've got crunchy rocks to eat over the weekend to get on the sofa. And then I also saw these and was just like, you know what? It's 31 degrees tomorrow. I'm going to be having one of these in the garden. Are you going to have one of these? Oh god, it's got popping candy in it. Oh, popping candy ice cream. And then I also picked up these two. So these are just things I generally like to snack on in the day. So the Naked Bars in the Blueberry are my favourites. You really like that flavour too, don't you? Really, really nice. And then I also, I actually haven't bought these for a while, but these are also another one that I love to have just as a snack in the day. So these are the Nature Valley Crunchy Oat and Dark Chocolate Bars. Love them. Oh, and I also felt like trying some of these Marmite rice cakes, because I love Marmite. 
and I haven't, I don't know how I feel about them on rice cakes, but I'm going to attempt. I've only got a little pack to see, and then if I like them, next week I might get a big pack. And then I also picked up these, because we eat these all the time, these are the caramel snacker jack rice cakes. We love these, don't we? Oh yeah, and 51 calories. There uh, we go. Yeah, nice. I, I often do put golden syrup on mine too, so I don't think it's 51 calories. And then we have our breads. So this is our breakfast bread. It's the best. If you haven't tried this, I used to eat this when I was younger. Other than tiger bread, poppy seed bread. Oh, it smells so good now. Let's smell that. Does smell good. Does smell good. And then we also have just, we usually get just a normal loaf that's already sliced because sometimes we like having toast. In the evenings, usually I might have a bit of toast with jam. I like that. And then these are my bagels, the onion and chive ones, which loads of you have said that you've started eating because they are really good. But I have these with my eggs and sometimes salmon as well. Then we have our eggs. Where are the eggs gone? Where are the eggs gone? Oh, there. So we've got my eggs, my free range eggs, and then we've got Niall Snobby eggs. <laughs> my happy eggs. The Clarence Court Burford Browns. Burford Browns. Oh, Though to be fair, they taste really nice. And then, I don't know what order to do all this in, because I should have done like categories. Oh, we also have some buns, because I'm um, doing the barbecue at some point this weekend, which will be lovely. And that's why we also have cheese slices. I really love chicken in a bun with some cheese and some ketchup. That's just my favorite thing on a barbecue. More than like normal burger and sausage. It's just, that's what I like. And then we also have some bacon. Actually, Niall picked up this chicken for the barbecue as well, which is a already seasoned Cajun one, which sounds quite nice. So we're gonna have that as well. Got some corn for the barbecue. I'm literally filming this whole thing. You can't see, see half of my head. Get involved, come on. Got, Tell us what we got. We got fabric conditioner. No, actually, let me show them this one because it looks so nice. It's a coconut bliss. Summer version. Ooh. Oh, you like it if your clothes smell like that, wouldn't you? Nice. You smell like I used to have a hair wax that smelled like that. We also have some oranges. Lily's kitchen for the cat. Oh, they wet. The dog and the pup. Oh, Lily's kitchen. Does anyone feed their pets Lily's kitchen food? Because we're even debating oh, dry food. Moving, yeah, the dry food. We're, we're debating moving them over to that because we just love Lily's kitchen. So let us know because we might do that. I do like it. We saw it in the supermarket today. And we're like, oh. That could be quite good from that. Yeah, that's good. And we also have some big oranges because we like to make fresh orange juice and squeeze it. Hash browns for our breakfasts because we have snazzy breakfast on the weekend. The brunch thing. Do you know what? We don't actually do our Saturday morning routine anymore though. Lots of people ask me if we still do that. It it's kind of like time. fizzled out. Well, Sunday we have breakfast on Saturday. Sometimes, but we don't do it in the way we used to, where I would lie in bed and watch Disney Plus and you'd make it. <laughs> no, we don't do that, no. <laughs> no, we don't do that, but I did expect that to last forever. That was a lockdown moment. Um, but we do often, one of the days on the weekend, try to have a nice breakfast, don't we? So we'll have hash browns. Last weekend we had Eggs Royale. I think that was one of my favorites, you know? Yeah, Eggs Royale. Niall's just so good at breakfast. And dinner. And dinner. And lunch. But you are really good at brunch food. Really good. Even a poached egg. Got some kale, because I like having kale as my veg, like my green more than anything really. I used to like broccoli, but I've kind of gone off it. Got some watermelon, because now I was going to make watermelon cocktails tomorrow. Aren't you? Watermelon margarita. Coffee. This is our favourite coffee. It's just an instant one. And then we have some frozen fruits, because we have them in our smoothie so this is my favorite one the strawberry and banana mix also got some beans because i fancied some beans on toast the other day and i used them up so i thought i'd get them again because it's always good to have beans in your cupboard isn't it yeah then we've got some rigatoni this is my favorite pasta love it we have pasta a lot in our house that's why we usually get things like sweet red peppers and onions and just lots of fresh vegetables we have in our fridge all the time we have quite a lot already that's why i didn't buy so much today because yeah we just often like chuck loads of veg in and make some with like pesto or chopped tomato Gar do you not say garlic no i didn't 
<laughs> that should be at the top of your list. I, where's the garlic? Onions. We bought some. Where'd it go? I put it in the fridge already. Put it away. Everyone knows what a bloody garlic looks like. Well, anyway. We also have some avocados because I love avocado with eggs. I have white vinegar because I like putting this in my pasta dishes. It makes it taste more extreme. Well, like that. well, come on then, what have you got to say about that? Well, you could act, that's not white, that's malt that's, vinegar. That's well, yeah, and I, it tastes nice in pasta, trust me. That's what you put on your chips, love. Oh, but I like it in pasta. It makes it nice. You know that's not coffee. It makes it tangy. Yeah, and I also got this because we always see them in the shop and they always look really nice. It's a coconut almond blend. And then this is what I have for breakfast. Fruit and fibre, actually often sold out, so I was very happy that I was there today. Prosecco for my Aperol spritz. And then we have some rices, which I just have sometimes if I want to have them. I don't know what to say about the rice. Uh, I mean, it's, it's a bit of a cop out than making normal rice, but it's, it's just easy, quick. It? Yeah, I like it with tuna and sweet corn and mayo. You just shove it in. And parmesan on top. Excuse me, don't judge. And yeah, I think that's basically it. And then we've just got my soya milks, which I usually get like four a week because we tend to drink so much milk. But that is our future. I'm trying to think. We also often get Philadelphia, but we've got a full one. Get my Philadelphia because I love having this with pesto to make a sauce for my pasta and cheddar and parmesan. Love a cheese. We didn't actually get any cheese today. <laughs> Oh, didn't need any cheese, did we, Baz? Anyway, that's basically our weekly food shop. Let us know what you think. I'll hopefully see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. You're finishing? Yeah, it's just the food oh, shop today. Right. Mm -hmm. We're good Say goodbye, it. Baz. Say bye, Bazzy Boo. Look at his ears. His ears are so long now. He looks like a perfect little puppy. <laughs> anyway, we're going to love you and leave you. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. When's this going up? And on Thursday. Oh, all right. <laughs> and I'll hopefully see you in the next one. See ya. Give us a wave. Have a good week, guys. Basil sends all of all of his love. Ready? Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm.